There's a new warning from police tonight as home burglaries continue to rise across Southern California. Thieves are using a tech tool to get inside your home that allows them to disable your alarm and your security cameras. Eyewitness News reporter Michelle Fisher live for us now in Glendale with new details about Wi-Fi jammers. Michelle. Well, Mark, the message from police tonight is to be vigilant. They say this is a tactic they have seen from thieves not only here in Glendale, but all across Southern California. Glendale is a very safe city. But tonight, a warning from Glendale police about Wi-Fi jamming devices, technology that could make your home a target for thieves. It's a device that blocks the signal or scrambles your Wi-Fi signal. So if you have a ring camera, a Nest camera, any kind of alarm system that is Wi-Fi based or a camera that's a Wi-Fi based, blocks the signal and knocks it out. A disproportionate surge in residential burglaries across Glendale and Southern California in the fall, leading investigators to the crime trend. As our detectives started going into these cases, they started realizing that this is what was happening. In some cases, because of the, the way the device works, it made it look like if you went and rewound your tape and looked, it was just a, it wasn't like a blank screen. It looked like it was seamless. It just didn't exist in there. So there was no evidence. Police say you can beef up security around your home by hardwiring alarm systems and cameras, using backup batteries in those devices, installing sturdy locks on security gates, enhancing exterior lighting, securing windows and balconies, and having a trusted neighbor or house sitter look after your home went away. The department's residential burglary task force too helpful in lowering the number of break-ins. Patrol officers, our motor officers, our special enforcement detail, our detectives, we had them undercover in the area and we saturated the area. I feel like there's no part of the city that you can be in and not run into a cop or not run into a police car. Just, I mean, if I stand here for five minutes, I might see like three, three cop cars drive by. So because of that, I feel like it's a safe city. And Glendale police tell us they have made some arrests and the investigation into these thieves remains ongoing, but they're asking anyone with information to please give them a call. We're live tonight in Glendale. Michelle Fisher, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. All right, Michelle, thank you. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC 7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC 7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.